Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So Microsoft has recently released a new DevOM app for Windows 11. Now, my main reason for mentioning the new DevOM app, um, which is mainly focused at developers to help keep track um, of their workflow and just to collate things into one convenient place. My main reason for mentioning the new release of the DevOM app is that the app now comes with new widgets that can help you to monitor your system resources on Windows 11, like your CPU, GPU, RAM, and your network utilization. And I actually think this may be the first set of so-called third-party widgets that, um, that I may actually use um, on a practical level uh, in Windows 11. Now, if you want to enable the um, new widgets on your widget board uh, in Windows 11, um, first of all, we need to head to the Microsoft Store where you can do a search for Dev Home. And uh, um, that will bring up the relevant app, which is still in preview. So just take note of that. And um, so you can expect to see a couple of bugs. And uh, um, once you've installed the app, um, once that app is installed, they, you then just navigate to your widgets in the bottom left of your taskbar on Windows 11. Click on that. And just take note of uh, one thing. When you first um, launch your widget board after installing the new DevOM app, you will see a banner at the top here of the widget board saying new widget available, which you'll have to click on. And then once you've done that, you can just head over to your add widgets. And here we get all our new widgets. There's one for CPU, GPU, network, and memory. And to add those, we just click on the relevant widget. Um, there we go. That's for my CPU to help monitor my CPU. Now my GPU, that's the graphic processing unit. Uh, let's head to memory. That's my RAM to help monitor my RAM. And then my network utilization as mentioned and i just want to refresh that and there we go so there's my four widgets which i actually think as mentioned is a nice move in the right direction and i actually think i may actually use one or two of these on a regular basis now um the default layout for the the actual widget is a a medium layout so um, a medium size so you can um change that to small so that's just an example of the cpu and the gpu running a small widget and we can also change those to large using the cpu and the gpu and the large actually gives you a couple of extra options where yeah you can see you can see extra processes that you can actually end and kill those processes very similar to what you get um in your um task manager uh, in Windows 11. So if you have the know-how, you can actually use this to end certain processes for those different tasks and system resources. But nonetheless, just bringing your attention to this, I actually think, as mentioned, this is a nice move and uh, um, just lets you help monitor and helps you monitor your system resources. And something else to take note of, over and above pinning the widgets to your actual um, widget board, if we head back to the app um, the widgets can also be pinned to the Dev Home Apps dashboard. So if you head to the dashboard and we head to Add Widget, yeah, you can see you can pin your CPU. Just to use another one as an example, your memory. So there you go, you get the idea. So you can actually pin those widgets to the dashboard, which now transforms the so-called um, Dev Home app for developers, if you're an average home user, into a nice system monitoring um, app and tool, which I th also think is another nice move. So you can also pin those to the dashboard. And uh, as mentioned at the start of this video, um, there are a couple of bugs. So currently, if we just head back to uh, the widget board, um, there is a bit of an issue, as we can see, trying to update in real time. So this may be a bug that does get ironed out. And I actually think when Microsoft does roll out the stable version of the dev app with these system resource uh, monitoring widgets, I actually think, as mentioned, this will be um, a very handy feature to just help you monitor your system resources. And uh, that's for your CPU, GPU, memory, and your network now available to pin to your widget board as um, system resource monitoring tools in Windows 11. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.